what's going on traders welcome back to another brand new video and i hope you guys have an amazing trading day so far in this video i'm going to be teaching you guys how to copy trades from your mt4 slash mt5 over to the new trading platforms such as c trader dx trade and of course trade locker as well and i hope you do find this video useful especially if you guys are trading in the prop room space whether you're trading live capital or with a forks broker this video will still help you out all right guys let's head over to tradersconnect.com this is one of the major copiers that we use it is a web-based slash cloud-based uh, copier and what that really means is you don't need to set up any type of software you know, or set up any type of VPS. Everything is done on their back end. All you need is your accounts that you want to copy to and from. And that's basically it. It is a paid service. It is very inexpensive. It's $10 per account. So usually you'll be spending about $20, one for your main account and one for an account that you want to send the trades over. So usually a master account and of course a slave account. This is what we call it. So usually it's about $20, and if you want to add more accounts, if you want to copy to multiple platform accounts, then you just have to pay $10 per account. All right, guys? So go ahead and go to this website, tradersconnect.com, make an account, and we'll be able to go into the next step, which is the dashboard. Uh, once you're in the dashboard, all you need to do is just click here, which is accounts. You'll be able to see this page, and you want to add your first account, which we deem it as the master account. This is where all the trades originate from. Ideally, you want to set up your EA or if you're automatically trading, you want to set up your EA on this master account first. But if you're trading manually, you can trade it on your desktop or trading on your 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 uh, phone. Um, all the trades will be transferred over to the slave accounts or whatever account that you choose to copy the trades to. Now, you can see here, I've already set up an account. It's our MT5 Gold Cypher EA uh, for the prop firms. Uh, all you need to do is to click on an account and follow the instructions. Usually, it's an MT4 and MT5. In this case, ours is an MT5. You put in the name, whatever name you want to name your account. We usually uh, name it uh, after our EAs. And, of course, we put a master there so we understand, so we, we acknowledge it. That is a master account. All the trades are originating from there. It just serves as a reminder for yourself as well. You click on the broker, click on the server, and of course, put in the account ID, which is the MT4 slash MT5 account number, and of course, the account password, which is the master password, not the investors. All right, guys, once you get that all set up, you'll have your master account connected, and of course, you want to turn on the connection if it's ticked off. You want to make sure it's on, right? Secondly, you want to add your slave account, and this is usually a proper account or just another account you want to copy your trades to. You're going to go click on that account. You can, again, follow the instructions. If you're a prop firm or whatever accounts on DX Trade, click on DX Trade, type in your nickname, which is the name of the account, the username, select the broker. If you're on, you know, Alpha, Alpha Capital, uh, Blueberry Markets, or you're in, on, let's say, any other broker like Fixify, uh, Fixify, you can put that as a broker, your username, and of course, your password. I actually have a 100K account uh, with me right now, so I'll be setting that up, and I will also be showing you guys how to set up the copier. Same thing for C Trader, same thing for Trade Locker. You guys just need to basically follow the instructions. It'll pull your account, and you'll be able to have them uh, connected here. All right, guys? So I'm just going to quickly uh, add this uh, Fixify, uh, Fixify account here, stickies here. So I blocked out all the numbers. I'm just going to put in the credentials right now, and we'll come back in the second part of this video. All right, guys, welcome back to the second part of this video. And as you can see, I've added the Fixify account here. It is actually a 200K challenge account on the DX trade platform and now we're going to set up the copier and configure the settings you're going to go into the left panel here you can click on the copier settings and you click on add a master copier copy from account you're going to choose your master account in our case it is the gold cipher ea i'm going to be copying over to our challenge account which is from fxify the slave account risk type we only use two risk types here which is the either the fixed lock size or the lot multiplier now fixed lot it's pretty self-explanatory you guys can put whatever lot sizes that you want depending on your trading goals or your proper balance 
If you're using our EA, such as the US-30 Omega or the Gladiator EA, then you will be selecting the fixed lot size. Now, in our case, we're going to be using our lot multiplier because we're using gold cipher EA. We're going to put 100% because we want to copy one-to-one. -one. We want to copy exactly whatever this EA is doing because the cipher cipher EA opens up the four layers or four positions, and it can uh, and it has different lot sizes for each positions. So we want to copy exactly whatever the EA is doing, all right? After you configure the settings, and feel free to change that. You can change it to 50%, change it to 80%, 120%, whatever fits your appetite. In our in our case, we're going to be using one-to-one. -one. All right, after you're going to click on the SL and TB settings, you're going to click on all three here, these three options here, and everything else we just leave as is because all uh, the the stop loss and the take profits, it is already customized on the EA. However, if there is a specific training goal in mind, then feel free to put in a predetermined fixed stop loss or a predetermined fixed tick profit. All right. Next, we're going to go into advanced settings and we're going to take here, which is the force minimum lot size. And down here, which says copy magic number, we always recommend turning that yes, uh, turning that, uh, selecting yes, because that will basically just copy your magic number from your EA over to this trade. Uh, your magic number on your EA is 100% unique. Um, of course, you can also click custom if there is any reason you want to put just a random magic number maybe you want to differentiate your trades or maybe you're managing multiple accounts then it might be a good idea to put in a custom magic number as opposed to your ea all right really depends on your setup all right so we're going to put on copy magic number from an original ea which is yes and the delay type which is basically a trade delay um, this feature is actually built in on our eas already all trades are random uh, uh, has a randomized delay feature um, it, it might fire a trade every few milliseconds it can be 10 milliseconds it could be 100 milliseconds really depends on the feature now for any reason you want to use this feature you can uh, if you have a trading goal in mind feel free to um, pick one of these trade delays but in our case we're going to be putting no trade delay after you guys can click on trade filters uh, trade filters and you guys guys kind of play you can play around with this now this is a little bit more advanced users if you want to filter trades by you know magic number filter by comments and it's usually used it's usually used for multiple accounts or multiple eas and multiple strategies uh, just to stay organized uh, but if you just want to keep it simple you only need one master ea a master account and one safe account you don't need to touch this at all after everything has been filled out you just click confirm and the copier will be turned on. If you need to map a symbol, uh, here's where you do it. There's also uh, an option in the uh, dashboard itself, but in our case, we don't need to do any type of symbol matching. But if you're using, let's say, US-30 or uh, transferring over to, uh, to FTMO account, you might need to map the US-30 to US-30.cash, all right, guys? And we'll, all, we'll help you set up all this stuff if you're using our EAs, all right? We're gonna click on continue, and now the copier is 100% online. It's already started trading. Now, for whatever reason, you need to pause it on your slave account. You just need to click here, which will pause the trades on the uh, Fixify account or your slave account. And if you uh, click on your, uh, click the button here, it will just stop the main copier from working. All right, guys. So if you're managing multiple accounts, you might want to shut. Uh, it, uh, each account individually but if you want to shut off the entire copier then you'll just click the master copier status here right guys that is how you set up the entire copier for your master accounts over to your slave accounts so i hope you guys found this uh video useful and guys if you need help passing a challenge if you're struggling in passing ftmo challenge effects of five challenges or funding pips whatever platforms i want to let you guys know we pass them with a hundred percent guarantee. We pass over six thousand plus challenges in the last two years. If you need any information, make sure you guys head over to our Telegram group, which I left a link in the description below. You guys can join. You can see all of the services and all of the results that we've uh, achieved over the last two years. We pass challenges. We also trade uh, profit accounts as well, and. To thank you guys for watching this video, I wanted to share with you an ebook uh, that we have developed. It is 100% free. It is a guide on how to pass a prop firm challenge if you guys are struggling with it and you are trying to attempt it by yourself. You guys can check out this free ebook. 
Uh, it has about six chapters, 20 pages. It's a very concise and has a lot of value uh, in this ebook. It explains everything about prop firms from uh, trading strategies all the way to psychology and, of course, even how to find prop firms that are reliable. All right, guys? And this ebook is 100% free. We don't need your email. We don't need your number. You will not get annoying text messages or any type of marketing. It is absolutely 100% free to download. All you need to do is join our Telegram channel hit the daily trading lessons uh, subtopic and you'll be able to find the download link here and you can get it a hundred percent free all right guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys hit that like button leave a comment in in the video below if you guys have any questions either it's positive or negative we'd love to hear your feedback and make sure you guys subscribe to our youtube channel all right that's it for me and i'll see you in the next one